The COVID-19 pandemic has reshaped the global landscape, prompting nations to re-evaluate their alliances. The growing closeness between India and the US is a notable shift. This US-India strategic partnership has advanced with a technology agreement, deepening strategic ties and leading to a three-way defense partnership. President Macron's visit to India is a diplomatic milestone and President Biden's invitation for a summer state visit to PM Modi signifies the emergence of new geopolitical synergies. Hi and welcome to TFI Post. I am your host Ananya Sharma. Let's begin with the video report. The recent outing of US National Security Advisor Jake Sullivan to New Delhi sheds light on the United States' favorable stance towards India. The Biden administration has given approval for GE, a global leader in military jet engines, to manufacture the 98 kilonewton thrust GE 414 engines in India in partnership with DRDO and a yet-to-be-determined private defense equipment company. This India-specific GE 414 INS-6 engine will power the LCA Mark II, which is set to be unveiled by the Aeronautical Development Agency next year and take flight by 2024. It will also power the under-development twin-engine advanced medium combat aircraft. Historically, the relationship between the United States and India was fraught with the United States showing preferences to Pakistan. However, in recent years, the United States has moved away from Pakistan. It has increased its focus on India as both nations face a common threat in China. In addition, the strengthening relationship between the two has also been influenced by increasing competition between the United States and France. India has a strong defense relationship with France, but the United States views India as a potential market for its defense industry. As a result, for the first time, the United States is agreeing for technology transfer. Recently, strategic talks between India and the United States have centered on expanding bilateral relations in new domains. Another aspect of these initiatives is to diversify the civil cooperation with India and extend it to a relatively unexplored domain of defense trade. India and Russia are revamping their defense ties to diversify domains with increase in civil collaborations, much to the disliking of the United States. Though the reduced dependence of India on Russia for defense equipment has shifted towards France instead of the United States. From a vantage point, the overtly generous approach of the United States towards India can be attributed as preparation for the potential visit by French President Emmanuel Macron to India. The said visit of the French president to India would expand the bilateral defense cooperation between the two nations. The visit is all the more important as the United States is eyeing to seal the deal on supplying deck-based jets to the Indian Navy in a multi-billion dollar contract. But recent expert reports have revealed that the French fighter Rafale is ahead of the American F-18 Super Hornet. This makes it imperative for the US administration to compensate on its inefficiency by providing additional packages in other deals. Additionally, according to the Press Trust of India, the US President Joe Biden has reportedly extended an invitation to Prime Minister Narendra Modi for a state visit this summer. The Prime Minister's office has reportedly accepted the invitation in principle. The invitation comes as India holds the presidency of the Group of 20 Nations or the G20. India will host several events related to the G20 leading up to the summit in September. But the summer invitation to Prime Minister Narendra Modi is seen as a follow-up of the visit of President Macron to India. Further, given the significance the arms lobby holds in the White House administration and functioning, the move of inviting PM Modi does not come as a surprise. However, at the same time it provides India with the leverage to negotiate better defence deals with the United States and France. Since both the nations are having stringent competition to win defence contracts with India, it provides India with an upper hand to derive more from the growing strategic partnerships and defence deals with the two like-minded nations.